Roswell Flight Test Crew here at AMA Expo 2016. Click subscribe now to keep up with our updates from the show. And I'm here with none other than Josh Bixler of Flight Test. How are you doing, Josh? Doing good, friend. How are you? I'm well. I'm well. And you've got a whole room set aside for you here at oh, Expo. What's great. going on? Yeah, we are so grateful to AMA. They gave us the educational area of the AMA Expo to engage a lot of families in our first make and take experience for AMA. Now, what you see behind me is a whole bunch of amazing families. We're going to filter over 200 families through these doors. And the goal here is to show them how they can build as a family, they can fly as a family, and of course, inevitably, they're going to crash as a family. Once they've built these things called the FT Sparrows, they're going to know every technique of every one of our models to be able to buy it so they can download the free plans, and hopefully, they'll take this experience home and continue on this journey, hopefully with RC and, uh, and all the advances to come. Now this is a um, glider, yeah. but did I overhear you can sort of retrofit it and make it a, more of an RC? Yeah, yeah, this is, uh, we call them happy accidents, but we really designed this as a chuck glider, and obviously people really love the drone talk and everything, so we really wanted to push the limits and, and have it be unconventional in style. So we went back to the natural uh, looking bird-like things, we designed this thing called the Sparrow. This makes a really great two-channel, three-channel, or four-channel platform, and our next coming uh, Monday's episode, we actually have it flying FPV, uh, getting chased down, and it is a really great easy fly platform, but the nice thing is it also breaks out how does a V-tail work? What's the science behind it? You know, what happens when you take ailerons and, and add the uh, V-tail? What channels do you need to change? So we want to use it as an educational tool. It's one sheet of foam board, about eight different pieces, and a lot of fun. Speaking of education, how deeply you guys are moving into the STEM education. Why don't you tell us a little bit about that? This is a passion project, to uh, say the least here. FT STEM is going to be launching in 2016. We have amazing people all over the country that are helping us. Uh, one person that's, uh, that's a big part of this is Jake Marshall. For the past three years, he's been using flight test product and concepts and videos to do his own STEM program, and he's an award-winning teacher. So we got to uh, get together with him, build a relationship, and he's on the team now, and he is building a STEM curriculum from K through 12 that meets all the national standards. So whether it's a school that needs the STEM uh, curriculum and also the product line, or whether someone that has their own uh, curriculum and just needs the products, we can meet that needs. Our number one passion is that we get aviation into every school that we possibly can. Absolutely. That's what matters most, I think, is bringing up that next generation, yeah. right? Well, you know, even if people aren't passionate about flight, the neat thing about it is everyone can relate to the laws of gravity. Uh, MISO, as I get older, I can relate even more. That's what we're really bringing into schools. It's not, let's teach you how to fly planes and build planes. It's, let's teach you how to conquer the laws of gravity. Well, that's the problem that we're identifying. And the student is graded and uh, addressed on how he addresses the problem that's given to him. And even if he fails, if he documents it well, that's really the value. Uh, as we go through life, if we have a failure in life and we document that well and we communicate that failure, that is sometimes 10 times more valuable than the success. You know, Semper Cadentis on our patch here, always <laughs> crashing, so I, I think we share that. Amen, brother. Amen. All right. Well, Josh, thank you so much for taking the, the time. opportunity. I look forward to doing some content with you guys, too. Yeah, let's definitely work together. All right, cool. And from uh, AMA Expo 2016, this is the Roswell Flight Test Crew signing off.